Uh, yeah, the, uh, we had a situation recently where uh, the, uh, we had some injuries and uh, we brought in Plokotnik, who uh, is a great young talent, uh, and he did, he did very well. Uh, we were hoping as well to bring our other uh, you know, team, great player from the uh, U-20s last year, uh, Vasilik, but uh, he's been injured, unfortunately, so we couldn't bring him, him in. Uh, otherwise, uh, I mean, we're getting great contribution so far this year from, from Novoda. Uh, Novoda's been really solid for us. Uh, especially with Romanchik uh, injured, he stepped in and done a great job. So he's a he's a guy that we really wanted to focus on and develop through through this season. He's getting a lot of ice time and and he's taking some steps forward. And that's all you can ask for with the young players is to um, to work hard in practice and continue to improve. And uh, when we see that improvement on a day to day basis and game to game, then then that means. Uh, uh, you know that's that's very positive. So we're seeing some good things from Novo. Um, you know, we we hope to uh, be able to find some some time for uh, from Vasilik this this season. Um, of course, I mean that's not the only uh, young players as well. I, I mean Haverla has been really good for us and made a big impact for us this season as well on the fourth line, being a physical uh, presence. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, we only have so many uh, spots for, for uh, young guys with the, uh, you know, we want to win, win games uh, as well. So uh, it's, it's always a tough situation to be able to bring in young, young players. And uh, we have had some practice with us to get to the taste of it. None of them, uh, are, uh, the other guys are quite ready to jump into to a game, but we're, uh, we're definitely working on trying to develop uh, and, and find, find spots for these guys. So we've had a good form uh, lately. We've won nine out of our last 11 games. In the last few, uh, we've had some some injuries that forced some players into some uh, some different roles. Uh, for example, Jokel had to play on the third line with uh, with Slovak, and, uh, and they were very effective. Uh, with him and and Lampy on the third line the other day, and uh, they did a great job. I thought Jokel did an excellent job stepping up and stepping in and being a Having an impact in the games, uh, um, so yeah, these uh, that when a when a we tried to build the team as deep as possible with players who can who can step in and play up in the lineup. So um, we've gotten contributions from a lot of different players in our kind of uh, run of, of good play. Uh, obviously, in the last eleven, we had a a couple uh, poor games. The one against Mikolotsa in Mikolotsa was not a not a good game, but I like the way. Guys um, bounce back after that. There's always going to be the, uh, the odd bad game, but you want to minimize them as much as possible. So we're playing good hockey. We're working really hard, um, and uh, you know, the, just lately we're finding ways to win win hockey games. So um, with uh, the state of the injured players, um, we had a practice today, and Lynette was on the ice, so he gives us uh, a lot of depth through our through our fourth line. So I'm very happy to. To have him back, um, Derny with uh, you know with Yanis in the lineup now, he's ready to be able to play. Derny, uh, we were only on a month contract with Derny, so he did a great job for us coming in and, and uh, protecting us and having two good goalies uh, after Kosho uh, was suspended and then we uh, released him. But uh, so Derny did a great job for us, and now he's uh, no longer with us. He, his month is out. Um, so we'll be seeing Yanis on the ice in games uh, within the next uh, few games. We haven't, we don't know exactly what our plan is with the goalies, but uh, Richie will be back uh, from national team, and, and Yanis will start to play some games. So very excited about seeing him on the ice. And uh, Bartanos is still going to need a little bit more time. Berti is uh, has an upper body injury, so um, he's going to take a little bit longer. And um, Romanchik is back skating full today, so uh, we have some injured players back. So we're looking forward to being back with, I uh, uh, don't need to fill holes in, in our lineup and we have our depth the way we want it to be. Um, just incredible news that we're coming back to, to Steel Arena. Uh, 
really we're really thankful for uh, all the support from you know from uh, the city and from the arena and of course a great job our management did in in putting it all or helping it all get put back together so um, you know I officially told the players this morning we had a couple of days off in the break and uh, most already knew about it but uh, everybody's very excited to get to get back here into our home um, it has been um, not the easiest to uh, to be at Crow Arena. It, it, uh, we're also thankful to Crow Arena for being there and for helping us uh, as well. But it's uh, you know it's it's not Steel Arena, so um, we uh, we're very excited to come back. Uh, it was a it was a tough process to start the season coming from here to to Crow Arena. So, um, but the guys adapted. Uh, I think they showed some mental toughness and adapted, but uh, of course it's a big relief to come back and uh, play in our home and uh, of course the atmosphere here uh, when we get uh, good fan support is, is amazing. What I saw in the playoffs last year is some of the best, possibly the best atmosphere uh, I've ever seen uh, in, in games that I've been involved with. So. Uh, game six against Mikulotsa comes to mind for sure. Game game uh, six also against uh, Slovan last year were just an incredible atmosphere, and it really helps the players and, and all of us get uh, get into games. And the emotion is so high, and it's a huge advantage for us when, when playing in Steel Arena with uh, with a crowd uh, excited and supporting us. And um, so I'm really really hoping that. Uh, uh, our fans come back and, and support us here at Steel Arena. I'm looking forward to, to having uh, that, that electric atmosphere that uh, is so important for, for our players. Uh, they'll be extremely excited in these first games against uh, Trenchin and Mikolaj just to get back on the ice. But uh, the fans really, uh, really lift us up and uh, looking forward to, uh, to huge support and seeing everybody back at the arena.